In this video, I will show you how to install and use my Trippy Text Motion Graphics preset for Premiere Pro. You can download this motion graphics or Mogad files absolutely free from my website harshwardhanart.com. The link is in the description section below. This motion graphics is fully customizable. You can customize it any way you want. You can change the text, you can resize it, scale it, rotate it, and you can be creative with it. And if you want to add the cool titles and and the typography on your videos then check out to this typographic bundle which has 400 plus elements and these all of these are drag and drop and you can customize them and you can add the amazing cool titles or text on your videos and take your videos to the next level the download link is in the description section below so without further ado let's get started So uh, once you download uh, this subscribe trippy text effect or subscribe trippy mogut motion graphics template from my website you will get a gif file and you need to extract that gif file and inside that you will find uh, this mogut files all right so you need to install it and for that purpose just go to the essential graphics in the premiere pro and if it is not shown over here go to the windows and select the essential graphics that way it would be available right over here and in the browse section you can see i have already installed it so one way to install is by just dragging and dropping if you are using a new version just drag and drop and that way this would be available right over here otherwise you can come down on the bottom and click on this plus icon and then browse the downloaded file wherever you have downloaded and just open and that way that would also be available right over here all right so now let me show you how you can use this so it's very easy and simple all you have to do just click and drop anywhere on your timeline or on your project and thereafter you can see if you go to the essential graphics once again once you have selected this there is an edit option and here we have all the option to customize it so you can customize it as per your own liking except the color so you cannot change the colors but you can change everything so first is the overall scale so that means overall scale allows you to scale it down the entire motion graphics all right so you can scale it up or scale it down all right so let me just make it default 100 is the by default and you can even adjust its opacity so if you want the less opacity you can adjust this slider and 100 percent is the default opacity and then we have the option to change its source text suppose if you don't want to have this text and you maybe you want to write your channel name or maybe you want to uh, write like and subscribe okay and that way it changes and you can see this is uh, cut from here this has been cropped all right so you can adjust this so if you just play it you can see this is cropped and for that purpose we need to scale down the font so we'll scale down the font and until it just shows clearly all right or the full text is shown and then you can change the font as well i have used the integral cf font you can found uh, the download link of this as well in the downloaded folder or you can change any other font of your own liking all right so you can change that font as well but i'm going to change it to the integral cf all right so that's the default font and i'm using the extra bold and let me just scale it down a little bit and then we have the all all other options you can choose uh, to fox bold so that becomes even bolder you can make it italic you can make it all caps it's already all cap so don't need to and you can make it small caps as well all right so we have all these options then we have the option to scale the font so we can scale this entire motion graphics okay so we can scale it down or we can rotate it the way you like it okay and zero is the default okay and then we have the option to adjust its position so we can adjust it x position or the y position okay so suppose you have the smaller text and you write a text not that big just like okay so what happens in this case the animation goes on this side so if you just play it just notice over here you can see this waves on this side rather than in the center so for this purpose we have this these options to adjust its position so we can adjust its position x or y so in this case we need to adjust the x position so if we 
hover over it and drag it on this side so it will keep on coming in the center so something like this where this is in the center and now we can just play it and you can see now this animation is waves very amazingly all right and let me scale it even further you can scale it up so let's play it so now this is how it looks isn't it great this is how you can use this trippy text motion graphics for premiere pro and you can customize it any way you want you can write your own text you can scale it up scale it down or you can play with it to be more creative all right if you want to learn how to add cool typography or cool amazing titles or text in premiere pro using the typography pack which is an amazing pack which has the 400 plus elements including titles lower third social media icons and youtube graphics watch this video right now on your screen or the link is in the description section below so thank you so much bye bye see you in the next video till then keep shooting and unleash the creative in you bye, -bye.